Hello, it's uh, me, Daku. Hey, I just wanted to give everyone a heads up that's using VTube Studio now because they're changing like from PRPR -PR Live or something else. I don't know. Most of you are using PRPR -PR Live if you're changing to VTube Studio. So, yeah. Uh, there's some stuff different from VTube Studio actually. First of all, expressions. If you want to get your expressions. Studio, they're differently used as in PRPR, PR, for example. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me make that more like it. There we go. Um, right, I just used Kiwi's model for that. Yeah, thank you. You have a CC, the name, and then CFG file with all the expressions in there that you don't need that for VTube Studio. You need the Live 2D Cubism Viewer, which is basically included in Live 2D. If you install Live 2D Cubism, the program you rig model is you but for this for the viewer itself you don't need the license for live 2d it is free you can always use it even if you have no license and uh, which is obviously nice obviously could you probably could just ask your rigger if they are nice <laughs> or if you want to do it yourself you can do that as well because it's really easy to get the expressions like you need the exp3 files which is like here right see yeah uh yeah <laughs> don't look at my bar um <laughs> then you see you take your mock 3 put it in here and then it opens up with window with your model and stuff here yes i have no legs i know i'm sorry <laughs> then you add expressions i'm gonna go quickly on this one because Twitter. Um you will call it blub you call that blub as well no, no. Blub blub blub. there we go. Just for testing purposes that's why I'm calling it like this. Then you go like here's the uh, nice breathing right then you search your uh, that's all the parameters you have you can even change the name here again. And if you find your expression you just say uh, curse mouth <laughs> um you even could like add two expressions in one just nice in vtube studio really nice but like most of the people have one expression on one and then you add a new one like the uh, expression uh, expression two expression two and then you add another one press on this one and then you like do dark circles for example and then you go export if you're finished put all expression motion and then, uh, yeah, okay, I'm already at the folder. You start at another different folder. You know how to get to, to your VTube Studio data. It's it's like in, like in where you installed Steam, more, more like where you installed, installed VTube Studio. For me, it's Steam. There we go, there we go. And it's VTube Studio data and then it's, um, streaming assets and then Live 2D models and then I could test, for example, because I'm testing purposes, right? Thank you. And you click on open and then it just, just do this. There we go. And then we have the exp plus d. There we go. Where is it? There we go. <laughs> nice names. And you can just close this. Yes. So. You, will just, you can close this too. Uh, or where you have your model actually saved. You put it obviously there. But for me, yeah, obviously you have it in. You have to put it in live 2D anyways. The next thing is, hey, you see me, you see me, let me just uh, send this off, so, it, hey, and it's two days. Yeah, you see, a lack of days. You click on it. First thing, that's, uh, if you, you probably use webcam, right? Yeah, here we go. Webcam, I'm using, you know, you see my mouth is not closed properly, but that I can show you too. Um, but the first thing is, you need to know. You need to know is if you import it the first time, you have no breathing animation, which is like, ugh. It's really easy to add though. No. Uh, that's the wrong button. You go here, right? Obviously have your settings here for your webcam. You wouldn't turn it on. Yes. And stuff other stuff your virtual camera and stuff that's the that's the real part 
if like I like this because you see slight movement in the hair can even add a bit more uh, physics things like this movement you know you can add your icon you can add an idle animation which is not your breathing animation by the way it's just the set actual animation file I have it on my real one uh, then you scroll down just scroll down add a new parameter not any input please you don't have to use it then you scroll down and search um, param most of the time it's called param breathe uh where did i put it <laughs> uh, there. there we go param breathe right then you got this and then you add an auto breathing now you have all your breathing animation again which like you don't know it's it's not set yeah if you want to add hotkeys that's this way you do this but that's the easy part um and then you go here tasing and you can do like key combinations i always use my numpad but you can also use like control and then one and here you have control run you have to press control run then but that's the easy part you can even do like like what i did go like Move model, record, and then move model again, which is really nice. I don't want to do that. Let me do this, and let me do that. Numpad. And we go at this corner, small, and then we cut position there, and then we do the. You can see, which is really nice. But that's not the main purpose. And if you, see, you can even do like this here. Right? You can do everything with video which the heads up as well like for example if you have issues with the mouth not closing yeah mouth open that's that's what i was searching for you see it's on 0 0.1 so we go like and add 0 0.1 or even more ways it hmm there we go, now it's not properly because of my mic. Okay, we go 0 0.08 this time. Yeah, there we go. Now my mouth is closed again, but I think with webcam itself uh, it's not the biggest problem, but you can like change stuff, smoothing, if something's too drop abrupt or smoothing and then it's like, don't go 100%. Here you go, now it's a bit more smoother, the mouth movement. You wanna have that? Uh, but yeah, you can actually change like everything. I mean, a lot of stuff is already known on Twitter, but yeah. I just wanted to give you a heads up with this. Hope it was helpful because at first I didn't know that was possible and stuff and how to do the expressions and the breathing wasn't even there. <laughs> but yeah. Mm -hmm. Almost halfway.